Hello everyone, Cool1177 here, and welcome back to the channel where today we are in the final episode of Phase 2, which is actually a little bit of a strange episode because we are getting ready for Phase 3. So just finishing off the area and things like that. And in today's episode, we've got quite a bit to tackle, including working on getting ready for this road in this space here, fixing the terrain so it's a little bit more level, adding in a bit more life in using some birds and things like that, and even implementing these brand new power lines that I'm working on. So we've got a ton to do in this episode. And of course, if you want to see more of this whole project that you see here, you can check me out on Instagram at cool1177 underscore creations, or you can just watch the previous episodes. They're all great ways to check it out. But without further ado, let's jump right into this, guys. Okay. Now, what you're about to see doesn't really look like a whole lot of progress, but this actually has taken me quite a bit of time, so I thought this would be a good little progress update. So, this is what we've done, basically. Uh, I've added in all the placements and things like that for everything, essentially. So, you can see that the road is a little bit lower than the sidewalk, just like the way I want it. I've got the sidewalk design pretty much installed. We'll add in some benches, some lamps, and things like that. I fixed up the shore over here. I think I might do a little bit more um, sand along here, but I'm not really sure yet. And then I've also added in the rock here. It's a little bit nicer looking. And we do have that nice beach there, which we're gonna populate up in just a few minutes here. But as you can see, we do have this all laid out here. We've got some stuff ready to go. This is the same fence that I actually used originally for this tunnel, but the tunnel is gonna be rebuilt anyways. So. I wanted to reuse it and I think it's going to look really good. So this sidewalk has to go all the way down to that park. So it's going to be a lot of pieces I'm going to have to purchase, but I'm really excited to see how that turns out. But we also do have to install this stuff here, which is I'm thinking going to be the new road plates because they are 16 by 16s. And this is a 16 by 16 as far as I'm aware. So I'm going to do all of that, hopefully, and they'll fit perfectly. I'm hoping. Um... <laughs> And uh, it's just going to have to go down a little bit lower so that it will fit with the sidewalk here. This will be raised up one uh, block just like over there. How you can see the sidewalk is a little bit raised. Uh, we're going to do the same thing over here. But it is going to have to get lowered slightly. And just with the current configuration of things, it's not going to work perfectly. So we're going to have to work on that. Um, but I don't have those road plates yet. But we will hopefully, if we don't get them in this episode, in the next episode. But... We do have a few more things that we need to do in these next few steps, and that would be to get these guys implemented, which I think we're going to actually put them down here. I think it's going to look a little bit nicer down here, but I am going to have to buy some thread for that. I'm not going to use the Lego official ones just because it doesn't work that great. And then we are going to populate that beach over there. So we'll see what I get to next, but I just have a lot to tackle here. You can see there's been some reconfiguration of the rock face and stuff like that. So it is... A lot to handle right now but uh, i think this will all be good once we get to that but yeah let's get into all of that stuff pretty much in one step let's go guys and after a few days of work i was able to get all of this done so i don't think this was what i originally intended to do at all uh especially not the train there but i'm really happy with it you can see i added in the hogwarts express which definitely wasn't going to be originally here but it just looks so cool so I do have to add a little bit of a stopper at the end here because otherwise it would just drive off the edge. So I'll do that, um, but right now I think it looks really cool. So hopefully in the next section I'll have that done. But you can also see I added in the power lines over here. I really love them here. I was originally going to put them down here on this sidewalk, which is a little bit of mess down there. But I ended up putting them here, which also gave me the opportunity to actually use Lego's elements for the strings, which I think looks really good. Just added in a few more details. We added in a bench and a... Uh, lamp there with our spacemen and I've got the palm tree here with our tree man actually and I also did some more work on the sidewalk you can see I added in this bike rental thing and I've also expanded all the way down to the distance that it needs to along with all of the treads along the edge which I'm gonna need to buy more of because I've already taken these off of literally every single vehicle I think that I have treads for so it is gonna be pretty pricey I would imagine so I'm not looking forward to that, and you can see I do also have a pattern going on this sidewalk, which also means I'm going to have to purchase some parts. So I do have a lot of that to do, which means probably I wouldn't doubt it if that doesn't get completed 
in phase three right away. So I apologize for that in advance. But yeah, we've gotten so much done in this section here. I'm just super happy with it. Uh, so in this next section here, we're going to build up some of these birds finally. Uh, and I'll probably scatter them around here. And I might build a few other things, including like the rail stop there and everything like that. But yeah, let's jump right into that. Okay, so after a little while of work, I was able to build a few more birds, but I actually focused this step on a few other things. But first, let's take a peek at the birds here. I added a bird up here. I really like this bird. And I added a interesting looking bird down here. Um, maybe like a crow or something. I'm not really sure. Now, I also added a few more things over in the Indian Reserve here. We've got a scorpion. We've got an owl. And we've also got our ox here. So, I'm really happy. I think I added a frog somewhere in here, but I can't quite remember. But yeah. Um, and then we also added in this rail stop, which was actually super cool. I'm really happy with how that turned out. I really think it completes the space. Kind of adds some color to the space that I really like. I'm just overall super happy with this. But there is something I noticed in this step that now I also need to fix. So we do have one final thing to do in this episode which kind of revolves around this area over here. So as you can see, we've added in some more plates here. I had to actually raise the sidewalk up one full plate. So it is looking a little ugly on the front here, but we are gonna correct that in a few minutes here. So as you can see this, I mean, you kind of can't see, but you can see now that the, um, the rock is now two plates it's three plates tall there which means that it's four plates tall over here which means when the road sits on this area it should all be raised correctly which should be perfect actually i'm really really happy with that so i do need to get the road plates but like i said we will have that in the next phase but as you can see down here this is only raised up two plates um which is not going to work uh, i need to raise it up three plates which means I'm going to have to do some work on the rocks. I'm going to take this layer of gray out and just bring the building up one full plate. And then we should be perfectly fine. So if you don't know, the new road plates are 16 by 16 plates, but they're also two plates tall. So it should be interesting uh, to get those in here, but we're not going to put the road plates in here in phase three. We'll get to that at a later phase, but we will be doing them up here uh, very, very soon. So uh, that's what I'm going to be doing in phase three, but now let's get into fixing this area and then we should be pretty much done here. So let's jump right into that. Guy. Okay. So after a few hours of frustration, pain, and realizing some things, I was able to get pretty much everything figured out. So first off, I realized in the last clip, actually, while I was recording it, that I had boosted this up by three studs which isn't supposed to be how it is. It's only supposed to be boosted up that those two plates like you see there because it's supposed to be in line with the road, which would make this sidewalk up three. But how it was, it was up actually four, which would not look right and it would look really, really wrong. It also would make it impossible to elevate the city buildings up to the right height without using tons of plates. So. I fixed all of that uh, very recently, and uh, there's a little bit of a problem here at the end, but I can get used to it. It's fine. Um, but yeah, it's just, it was a lot of pain to do that. So now that's fixed. And we also fixed down here, which you can see now it's elevated by three plates, which is perfect. So when the road is in here, it should be kind of like this, which should be perfect. I'm really happy with that. That means that the road will be in line with this rock here and everything like that, which I actually think I'll like because then maybe I'll have like cars pulled up, parked or something. I'm not really sure yet. We also need to figure out what I'm doing in this area here, but I'll just do that in my own time. Maybe, I don't know if we'll do that in this phase at all actually, but yeah, now we've pretty much got everything done and I don't want to show you too much just because I want a little bit of an incentive for you to watch the next video coming out next week, which will of course be the cinematic video. So if you wanna see that, you'll just have to wait one more week and we'll have that out for you. But 
yeah, we got a ton done in this episode. A lot on the sidewalk. You can see I'm getting stuff ready. I've got the roads cleared out. I've got some base plates in here. I got some street lamps up. I don't know if these will be the ones I actually use. These are just the old ones I had for the tunnel. And yeah, in the next phase, phase three, we'll be building up this whole space. So it should be awesome. And I'm very excited. So I hope you guys are excited as well. If you are, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe so you don't miss it because I would not want you to miss it. I don't want to miss it either because I'm super excited for it. So you might as well stick around for the ride. And yeah, that's all I've got for today, guys. Make sure to like and subscribe, like I said. And for now, this is Cool1177 saying over and out, guys. Yeah.